To the west of Hue, along the Perfume River, you will see a very popular tourist site, that of the Temple of the Celestial Lady, Tenmuk Pagoda, as they will be known locally. The Celestial Lady, uh, in reference there, play an important role in the founding myth of Hue to the ancestor of the Nguyen dynasty. And in fact, its importance is perpetuated by subsequent Nguyen emperors, especially in the first half of the 19th century. The third emperor, Emperor Teotrik, uh, patronized uh, the site and uh, highlighted the importance of the site through, uh, among projects, uh, through projects such as uh, uh, um, elevating a, elevating the site to be one of the 20 views of the divine capital. Uh, in fact, the, the, uh, the temple is the 13th view. Along with poems that he had composed in the 1840s, he had also uh, in, uh, created uh, works on uh, pictorial images of the site through woodblock prints, as well as reverse glass paintings. His poems are also immortalized in the, uh, on stone steely plays on the site, uh, such as the one that you see here. The site continued to be a popular uh, destination for Vietnamese and non-Vietnamese alike. During the colonial period, it was a popular a uh, place to visit for many European, French and European visitors. Uh, it is interestingly that this was mistaken often in these postcards as the Temple of Confucius or the Pagoda of Confucius. Uh, that particular building, in fact, it is much, uh, not too far away. It's just a short 10 minute walk from this particular temple, a little bit more to the west of this particular temple. temple. Today, the site continued to be a very popular destination for visitors to Hue. Uh, this is probably the second most visited place uh, other than the Imperial City. However, it is interesting to note that the site continues to change uh, in recent years, specifically since the aftermath of uh, the Vietnam War. Note that this on this Instagram page, the icon that advertised uh, Tenbuk uh, Pagoda is the car that was used to transport the very famous act during the Vietnam War of the monk <coughs> Thich Quang Duc, who sort of set himself on fire on the street of Saigon. And this car became a type of Buddhist relic. And this type of political and religious relic became enshrined in Tenbuk Temple and remaking, continue to remake that site. <clears throat> 